Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Modesty33, aka Crystal with the C, back at you with another video. This should be maybe a quick video. I don't know. I probably will attach this to something else. Um, because I did get um I'm in my car right now, first of all. So um I just was out running a few errands and had one of my um lipsticks that I just got in the mail um like yesterday with me and again I'm in South Carolina it's a little hot out so I didn't want to leave the lipstick in the car I'm actually not home I'm about to take a walk get a little bit of exercise in in my life um so I didn't want to leave the lipstick in the car because I don't I've never had experience with this particular lipstick and then like I said it's not like summer hot but it's still on the warmer side so um, yeah, like I wanted to go ahead. I just said I was going to take the opportunity before I get to my walk to do a first impressions for you of this particular lipstick and an unbagging. It's not a box. So, um, we're going to go ahead and do that. But hopefully by now you have seen my first impression of the other lipsticks that I purchased through this, um, through the Sephora VIB sale. This particular lipstick was not purchased through the Sephora VIB sale. This was just purchased, um, through Macy's and I got 6% cash back through Ebates. If you're not signed up for Ebates, why are you sleeping on it? Especially if you shop online. So Ebates has a lot of different stores on there where you can get cash back for your purchases. So on this particular purchase of this lipstick, I got 6% cash back. So, um, you know, and it may not seem like a lot, but you know, it adds up and then they do give you the payment like every three months. So by that time, especially again, if you're online shopping, like, you know, Mother's Day is coming up at the time that I'm filming this video. I don't know when I'm going to put this video out. Maybe Mother's Day will have passed. But if it's before Mother's Day, Mother's Day is coming up. Like, you know, you can't readily necessarily go to the store, buy something, and then have it shipped or something. Like, you know, so a lot of us do online shop and send packages. And sometimes it's better that way. People are surprised. Yay, I got a package in the mail. So, um did just kind of want to show you guys my first impressions of this particular lipstick as I did with the other two so let us begin so yeah this is my shipping information so it came in this little bubble wrap here that says Macy's and let's open it up it's got my little shipping label here from Macy's my little invoice oh what is this I don't know what this is. Exclusive offer, wine cellar. You got a cold. Um, choose red, whites, or mixed dozen. Three bonus. So that's 760. Um, I don't need that. I don't drink wine. Um, I was excited. I thought it was something I could use. Um, what is this? Made to love, shutterfly, free, photo book. Yeah, this is just stuff that came with the lipstick. It's cool, I guess. So this is the box that the lipstick comes in you guys and it is a dior lipstick dior rouge um and i'm just gonna show you let me see okay i don't want to cover it up but this is the i'm um, sorry the lighting isn't the best i'm outside again so it's very sunny but this is the Re rouge dior um double rouge lipstick this is 480 and this is in mysterious calypso so it's kind of like a mauve color these are tend to be the colors i gravitate toward nowadays um and this is the rouge dior double rouge um and this is the matte metal color and couture contour lipstick from Dior. Um, this package has 3.5 grams, 0 0.12 ounces. So I think it retailed for, does it tell me on the invoice? $37. Um, yeah, $37 is what this particular Dior lipstick retailed for. And then like I said, I got 6% cash back through Ebates. It was like $2 for shipping. So um anyway so not cheap by any means so we'll see how it does so when you open the package up here it's got the cd for christian dior and let me tell you like right now i've got on my um 
Chris or my Dior um, Attic Lip Balm on and the Raspberry. I actually like this by itself. It just gives your lips like a little hint of color. Um, and I noticed like when I actually, cause I'm in the process of editing another video, um, and that video will probably be up on the channel by the time you see this particular clip. But, um, I noticed that like before I put on my other two lipsticks, the Dior, um, not Dior, but before I put on the, um, the Tom Ford and the, um, NARS lipstick, like my lips already look like they had something on them. So I'm not really used to that in the balm. So, um, I really do actually like these Dior lip glows. So again, um, there's, you know, I've talked to, about them now in multiple videos. So, you know, again, if you have the funds, if you catch a sale or cash back through eBay, y'all, like definitely get one. I really highly recommend these. So this is what the Dior lipstick looks like when I take it out of the packaging. Really pretty black package, sleek. <clears throat> and this is the Rouge Dior Double Rouge, again on the bottom. And again, the color is 480 Mysterious Calypso. And I happen to see this lipstick. Um, oh, like there's somebody I just recently subscribed to and she went to like a Dior store. She lives in New Jersey and goes shopping in New York. So she went to it like a Dior um, boutique with, or like, you know, a Dior store within like one of the, you know, malls there and tried um, not this particular lipstick, it was another color, but it was my first time kind of seeing this particular lipstick. And let me show you what it is because I don't have a lipstick like this in my collection. Even though I might have similar colors, I don't have a lipstick quite like this. But this is look, what it looks like when you open it. So it's nice silver packaging. And this is the lipstick. And it has, you see here, Dior. And if you notice, it looks like it's two-toned and it is it is um called the double rouge because um it actually has a metallic finish on the inside and then the matte lipstick is on the outer side and so um it's got essentially two different colors so it's kind of designed to give like an ombre type of effect so um, I said, I just thought it was kind of cool. I watched some videos on it as well as like some tutorials. So I wanted to see like if I, if I could actually get the ombre effect or like if it would just, you know, look different on my lips, which I don't care either way, but on the inside of this little tube, it's like actually red. So that's kind of cool. So, um, we'll go ahead and try this on. I don't, do I have my mirror with me? Yes, I do. Okay, let me get my mirror out and again, do the right thing in my life. So I'm going to go ahead and try this on. I think when I read the instructions for this, you're supposed to like line your lips on the outside with like kind of the tip part and then you just kind of put it on regularly like a lipstick and then that's how you kind of semi get the ombre effect. So we'll go ahead and try to do that. So I'm just going to be looking down at this mirror, you guys, and... Um, actually, let me dab a little bit of this Dior off. Um, and by the time you've watched this video, um, I done already returned one of them, um, lipsticks that I bought and swatched in the other video. Um, and I may actually return the other one too, but we'll see what happens in the next few days. I've had allergic reaction, y'all, to something. It's one of those luxury lipsticks. I don't know if it was the NARS, and I don't know if it was either the NARS or the Tom Ford. I do not know, but one of them gave me an allergic reaction, and one of them has already gone back. The other one might go back. So when I come back to y'all and do a review of all these lipsticks and kind of let you know my all overall opinion, I will let you know what lipsticks went back. Um, if, you know, one has already gone back, like I said, both, the other one may go back. I'm wearing it this week and see if my lips still are not well. Um, so we'll see. And I'll let y'all know when I do a follow-up video. But let me try this on so I can go ahead and hurry up and do my walk, get my life together. Hopefully this don't break me. I don't know. It's soft though. I just wiped some of that Dior off too. So... Isn't this fun, guys? Let me get up a little bit closer. You can see. Um, you're not. It's again. This is natural light, so it, it's always going to kind of look a little bit different. But hmm.
I'm, I'm sorry. I'm like looking. Let me put this to the side a little bit. I don't see no ombre. I'm going to keep it 100 with y'all. I don't see no ombre. I don't see no matte metal. But I really do like this color though. This is it. Oh my gosh. Now this is a creamy formula. Um, First impression y'all. Like, and I wiped, I just wiped off that Dior. Yeah, this is a creamy formula. Creamier, I would say, than the Tom Ford. And creamier, maybe even creamier than the NARS. This Dior. Like, this feels like refreshing to my lips. Because my lips don't feel quite right. I don't know if it's an ingredient in one of those, like, NARS or Tom Ford lipsticks. But when it was, like... When I put one or both of those on, like, my lips broke out and swole up. Like, so I don't know if it's an ingredient in one of those lipsticks or what. But, um, yeah, this feels really good. And I like the color. Oh, I wish I would have worn this to the product launch, honey. I didn't have the lipstick, I don't think, when uh, the product launch. Yeah, I just got this yesterday, so product launch has passed. Oh, yeah, this is this is hot. I'm definitely keeping this. I wouldn't really see the point in returning it anyway, but um, I could go to a Macy's. Yeah, I do have a Macy's here, so I could return it if I was so inclined to. Um, but this is what it looks like after the fact. So possibly with this particular lipstick that has the ombre, you may have to come like use it a few times in order to actually get the ombre effect because I didn't, I guess when I looked at other people's videos and I like looked at... um. Like, I, I looked at other people's videos. I feel like you have to use it for a minute to, in order to kind of, like, get more of the metallic out. So, um, I'm going to do that. But even for me, without the metallic, I really like this color. So, um, wow, I really like this color. So, anyway, guys, that's my first impression. But um, let me come in a little bit closer so y'all can see. I don't know. The light, again, like I told y'all, it's um natural lighting. So, I'm in my car. About to take this walk and get my life together. So, anyway, hopefully y'all can kind of see that. And if I come back a little bit, that's how it looks. Y'all got my Hepta Boule Boutique earrings in. These are extra large, $12. Again, the link, um, I might put the link in this video too. Y'all get y'all a pair of these earrings Ship in the USA. You know, if you're in the USA, like she does ship um, within the USA. So check out her boutique, Hepta Boule Boutique LLC. So um, I'll try to put link that to this video as well. But I really like these earrings too. I feel like they match so many things. And I'm typically like a purple type of person. So kind of like them so i'm just gonna show y'all the earrings with the lipstick you know review so anyway guys that's the only thing i wanted to talk about in this video i'm gonna go ahead and go for my walk i've got other things to do today so um i hope you enjoy this video and the change of scenery so i'm just um not in my actual neighborhood i actually go to a neighborhood that um is close to my neighborhood and i like to walk around this particular area just because, I don't know, I like to look at the scenery and the houses and stuff. So, anyway, guys, I will see you in my next video, and I hope you enjoyed. And, um, again, if you like this um, first impressions video, make sure before you leave this video, you give it a thumbs up. Um, also, make sure you share this video with anyone else who's curious about these Dior Double Rouge lipsticks because I did not see a lot of reviews on them. That's why I want to make sure I did my first impressions and then come back to you guys with a um, more thorough review along with the other luxury lipsticks that I have. Um, if I still have any after I figure out where the allergic reaction is coming from. So um, I may come back to you just with this Dior. We'll see. <laughs> but um, yeah, anyway, guys, make sure again you share this video. Also, make sure you comment below. Let me know what you guys think of this color, what you think of um, these Double Rouge lipsticks, if you happen to have one. Also, make sure before you leave this video, you hit the red button below to subscribe to my channel. And make sure you hit the bell next to it so you're notified when I upload future videos. So y'all, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and go get out this car because it's hot up in here. And I'm going to take this walk, sweat a little bit take a shower and i may go see avengers infinity war i gotta see what because i got a neighborhood meeting tonight too i gotta see what i'm gonna do with my life so hope you guys enjoy but i will see you in my next video and have a great day guys bye